The Joy Business Van, empowered by Joy Business and supported by Busy, making good things happen. Echobank, the Pan-African Bank. Michael Dakwa, Timothy Adai and Imano Gamo share a common passion, photography. They are co-founders of Team Thousand Words, a rising name in the field of photography in Ghana. The three were individually pursuing their passion and did not meet until 2013 when they had to work together on a couple of projects. They thought they could do a whole lot more if they came together to pool their creative abilities. And that's when Team Thousand Words started. The name of their company is derived from the cliche, a picture is worth a thousand words. Come a bit quicker okay. and then uh, good. Yeah. Hey, step forward just slightly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was good that we've had, like, we'd had personal journeys. We were actually in good position because most we had had a bit of equipment. So in coming together, we we were able to start quite you know enough or substantial equipment at the beginning, and then we were really strategic with with what we wanted to achieve. Team Thousand Words broke into the market through wedding photography. There was just something different about the pictures they took. When we started out, we were very heavy in that department. So oftentimes when you look at our social media pages and so on, you'll see a lot of wedding photography. And that was our, our signature public product. But soon, the team decided to invest in content generation driven by the desire to tell a positive story about Africa. A lot of the times uh, in the international world, when people mention Africa, there's a certain uh, concept that they have, certain agendas which are being pushed. Like maybe it's not so developed or there are political issues. Sometimes people uh, imply about Africa. We want to be able to show people what Ghana is really like, what Africa is really like. But are they making headway? I think we have, and um, I'm basing it on the testimony of some of my friends who travel abroad to school, for instance. So uh, I have a friend hit me up sometime, it's like they had to do a presentation in class about Ghana, right? And they wanted to show something different to their classmates. So the first thing they did was to show pictures from our Facebook page and afterwards direct their friends to the Facebook page. And he said the experience was very different for his classmates because they, were, they felt they were having an authentic feel. Just like other businesses in the industry, the co-founders of Team Thousand Words have to grapple with the high cost of equipment and competition from other photographers. With more people using mobile phones, there's been an increase in the number of amateur photographers, making the profession less prestigious. So how do they handle this? Whatever situation we find ourselves in, we're going to have to create great work. And so because of that, I think the proliferation of mobile devices and everybody having a camera on them is really galvanizing us to produce better work all the time. That we really have to raise the bar, we really have to go that extra mile to make sure that people are satisfied with what we are giving. Their profession may be driven by passion, but the young entrepreneurs know they need to be strategic to make their business sustainable. This year, is giving us opportunities to explore newer things and because these are newer things you know steps may be unsure but we have a sense of direction and we are pursuing it so yeah not smooth sailing but the hands are you know and pushing the odds so. i think another thing that helped us was uh, from the beginning we decided that uh, team thousand words will grow organically so we're not going to go and borrow large sums of money and throw it at buying everything uh, imaginable or doing massive amounts of advertising which will, will suck in a lot of funds, we decided that we are going to build our client base one by one. That's the strategy to grow the company in a sustainable way and increase profitability. And they are doing this 
with the power of teamwork 